All right, welcome back. We are suited and armored and ready to go, ladies and gentlemen. Thrifty <laughs> Lobster here. Getting ready to go into Dollar Tree. And then after that, we're going to head right next door to the Goodwill. So say hello to the Dollar. And then over there is the Goodwill and that building somewhere in there. Just around the corner right there. So we're going to put this on pause. And we are going to go in and take just a quick second to see if they got a product that I sell on Amazon. And if they do, we're going to grab it. We're going to bring it out. I'm not going to show you some preparing you for that. Then we're going to jump over to the Goodwill. I'm going to put this on pause. I'll come back. I know I said I wouldn't edit, but we're running low on battery. I'm trying to do this quick because you don't need to spend a lot of time in the store because you're going to spend unnecessary money you don't need to spend. And in the Dollar Tree, it's dangerous in there. One dollar leads to a hundred dollars. So I'll be back. Where is my product? Where can it be? Nope. I do not see. I do not see. All right. Houston, we have a problem. We have a problem. Okay. Moving on. Dun, 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 dun. Basket is still empty. There. Um, ooh. Hello. Hello. What do we have here? I know that will sell, but the problem is not much of a return. Hmm. I'll be right back. All right, empty-handed. Nothing from there today. That product wasn't gonna bring us to where we want it to be. So we're gonna see if the Goodwill is open. Oh no. Fortunately, temporarily closed. What the hell? What the hell? Well, there you go. Takes care of that. Three stores within probably, I'd say 35 minutes or so. And we weren't able to go in one of them. So, yeah. So for those that are having the opportunity to go into the Goodwills, I envy you. I do. However, my day will come. Now here's the thing with the Goodwills. I'm thinking, the inventory hasn't changed much since we went into this whole lockdown thing. And I'm personally not too excited about going in there because I know there's not going to be a whole lot of new inventory. But I do have that itch and I do need to get in there and I do need to scan because there's certain things that I look for when I go in there. And if there's stuff in there, I want to get in there. But I don't see a... Uh, a date of when they, you know, are projecting to have us go in or open their doors, which it is what it is. So I'm not going to complain right now, which may sound like I am. But anyway, guys, hit the thumbs up. It'll definitely help me out. I appreciate it. If you haven't already subscribed to the channel, yeah, I, I don't necessarily do these kind of videos. I don't really show what I buy. Uh, especially when it goes to Amazon. I do show you how to save money. So if you can take those principles uh, and apply it to retail arbitrage, they're the same that I apply when I purchase things. I hit the Dollar Trees for certain items. Not As you can see, I just went in, went out. I have two, three, four, maybe five items I pull from there. Um, not everything does well. Not everything you can sell on there. Um, 
because of quality, because of branding, because of competition. There's, there's, there's probably a few other things that you can think of that would cause you not to want to buy from there. The Goodwill, obviously everyone does that. It's a, it's a way to source. CVS, way to source. The concept of buying with coupons to save money to buy sale priced items. Uh, earlier today, I went into a local grocery store and I have units back there that I purchased that you can't see. I just had to make sure. Um, they didn't give me a hard time about buying more than what I bought. I bought everything off their shelf. Um, probably at the beginning of this whole pandemic it was probably maybe a concern, but at this point it's not and it's hard to get that item. So price on that goes up. Anyway. Like, subscribe, thanks for watching. I guess this is gonna be part three of the journey of the CBS uh, couponing Dollar Tree Goodwill extravaganza that didn't even happen at the Goodwill because they haven't opened it. Um, I guess they're slowly opening things towards the West Coast here in California, so I'm waiting patiently. So anyway, guys, take care. I'll see you guys in the next time. Next time? Next time. Next one. Next one. Yeah, that's it, that's it. See you guys later.